What's going on everybody? This is Alex KGB. So a couple of things that I wanted to talk about. First is update on my build. So as you can see, I added Seren DPT. I'm not sure how to pronounce that right. But yes, so endurance now is down to four. Luck is up to 13. So there are some adjustments and I also picked level to nerd bridge for the intelligence. Intelligence is up 12. So I think this is the final version of my PvP build for the heavy gun and I'm already found a gun most likely gonna be my main gun and I will show it to you just in a second. Uh, but also as of now I'm doing pretty much basic melee unyielding bloodied build because it's so much faster to level up using that. You don't need to waste ammo with melee. The more unyielding armor you have on, the easier it's to run around because you know your AP count goes up, you, everything goes up. As of now, for, just for the farming purposes, uh, this is how it looks right now. I'm just laying out the stats for now. Yeah, but definitely melee with unyielding armor and bloodied melee is a way to go if you want to farm fast that's the most convenient build but uh, the end result is going to be this uh, that's going to be my main heavy weapon build and as you remember i'm doing this because heavy weapons did get buff i picked up this anti-armor light machine gun today in the uranium fever event so i was just hitting one hitting everything and following a guy who's was clearing out the rest but yeah I got this and ignores 50% of your target armor, 25% faster fire rate for this gun and the faster movement speed while aiming. It's level 40, does 34 damage. Apparently, you know, there are no modification to it yet, but as soon as I'm going to build everything as it should be, get all the proper mods, I think this gun going to be awesome. So this is kind of an update on the build where it is right now and how it how it's going. Now the other thing that I want to talk about is apparently Bethesda unbanned people and then banned them right away, which is insane. Now don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to say that duping is fine and it should be tolerated. Absolutely not. They deserve their bans, but the problem is with a lot of people that got banned and then unbanned, they actually followed the steps that Bethesda was asking them to do, got rid of all the duped items, they deleted their extra items, they should be good to go. And then all of a sudden, they started banning them again. Now, the guy who I did the interview, you can find the videos in the description, so he said that he was unbanned as well first, and then he said that he was banned. And a lot of people are actually saying, you know, I want my refund now, I'm so pissed, and I do get the frustration. Again, I'm not defending the dupers, but uh, assuming that you followed all the steps and you were forgiven and you got the, into the game, and then again, your account is banned, it just sucks. It's just bad. It doesn't matter if they duped or not, but overall, I don't think it's a professional behavior from the company. I read some rumors that they ran a script that was faulty and actually unbanned everyone the which is a problem i agree but at least issue an official statement on the support or on reddit on twitter wherever just explain what's going on and what are the steps moving forward in terms of people being banned who's gonna get unbanned and what they need to do to actually stay unbanned obviously they don't they should not dupe or cheat again but at least you know give some update why would i get unbanned and then ban right away it's like you know oh we have this awesome event you guys uh unbanned you can participate in it and then no you don't it's it, it's sort of like trolling but it is not i know it's probably bethesda is just doing bethesda things releasing buggy quad that's what it is but yeah definitely the approach with this should be better they should have a clear statement and a clear update when they're gonna unban people, what steps are needed, and why they're unbanning and banning the way they do it right now. It is a sensitive area. People did pay the money uh, to play the game. They violated terms of service, they got terminated, but then, you know, there was a hope they're gonna be forgiven, they were forgiven, and then for no reason banned again without any explanation. That, that's just not right. Those are the updates. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. This was Alex KGB and bye bye.